do you own a camera which has a 105 millimeter filter thread on it and you're thinking wow they're really expensive filters and you just want it to protect the element this is for digital well look no further UV slim filter You see it's pretty thin. If you what first thing to do it should be clean anyway, but as you can get a blower as well. Just blow off any old dust and stuff. Get a bit of clean, you shouldn't have to, but it doesn't hurt to there you go, a bit a bit's come off. Give that a clean. Yep. And what you do, you get the lens out. Today we're going to have the Sigma 120 to 300mm Sport. Which is a beast of a lens. If you get it new, it should come in a nice case as well. It gets a nice lens hood as well. This is a big lens hood. Massive. Good thing about the Sigma 120 300mm, if you need to get a new one of these, you can order them for about 100 quid. So, not too bad compared to the Canon equivalent. Right, take the thread off. As you see, it's a 105mm. The first thing to do before you put any filter on is give it a bit of a clean. There you go, getting a bit of dust out of it. Give it a blow all the way around. Don't, don't mark the uh, element though, no, because obviously it could scratch otherwise if you do mark it onto the glass. Right, that should be enough. Give it a quick check. A bit more sorted right, and then to screw the uh, the filter should be bayonet fitting. Make sure you get the right edge, the right size. Click it on, and screw to the left, to the right. Yeah, to the right. Gently screw it on. Screw it on. And there you go. Bit of glass just to protect it slightly. Maybe as well just blow a bit of dust out of it as well and filter. So, lens cap. And then just stick that back on. Right, holding that down for two clicks. You see, and put that on. See if it fits on. Yep, yeah, it fits on nicely still. So if you're the owner of a Sigma 120 to 300mm Sport, this filter will fit.